Man United staff left emotional as Ole Gunnar Solskjaer sends gifts despite Glazer's sacking. Manchester United staff have been left emotional after Ole Gunnar Solskjaer sent them Christmas gifts, reports say. The Norwegian was axed by the Glazers last month after overseeing a nightmare start to the season. Ralf Rangnick has been brought in to steady the ship as his interim replacement, with the German winning two of his first three matches at the helm. Solskjaer was a popular player at United, especially given he famously scored the winner in the 1999 Champions League final. Following the sacking of Jose Mourinho in December 2018, the 48-year-old was given the Red Devils job after impressing during a temporary spell at the helm. For two years, United made solid progress under Solskjaer. They finished second and third during the Norwegians' two full seasons in charge, while also making last term's Europa League final. However, after signing the likes of Jadon Sancho, Rafael Varane and Cristiano Ronaldo during the summer, Solskjaer was unable to get the best from his players. He was sacked last month by the Glazers and Ed Woodward, less than 24 hours after he'd overseen a nightmare 4-1 defeat to Watford at Vicarage Road. When Solskjaer left Carrington for the final time, he was emotional. Think you know sport? Test your sporting knowledge with our tricky quiz so too were members of the club's staff, many of which had been hoping the former number 20 would be the one to bring the glory days back to Old Trafford. Now, the Daily Mail say Solskjaer has moved staff by sending Christmas hampers, despite the brutal nature of his departure mere weeks ago. It's claimed people at Carrington were surprised when hampers containing gifts arrived, with Solskjaer behind the kind gesture. And it sparked an emotional reaction, with the former United manager showing his classy side despite losing his job. Solskjaer wasn't the only United legend to depart in the last few weeks. The Red Devils also saw former midfielder Michael Carrick step aside after he'd taken charge of the team in the immediate aftermath of Solskjaer's exit. Don't miss Arteta can't ignore glaring change needed at Arsenal Man United staff conflicted over Ronaldo and Fernandes Messi hits back at Barcelona over playing for free Carrick was given the job on a temporary basis and did well, securing victories over Villarreal and Arsenal with a draw against Atalanta in between. But despite Rangnick wanting him to stay, the five-time Premier League winner opted to leave for a new challenge instead. In the time since Carrick's exit, United have won two of their first three matches under their new manager. Rangnick got his reign off to a positive start with a 1-0 victory over Crystal Palace at Old Trafford, with Fred scoring the winner. The Red Devils then made 11 changes for last week's Champions League match with Young Boys, where they drew 1-1 at Old Trafford. Yet United returned to winning ways on Saturday, with Cristiano Ronaldo's penalty giving them a narrow victory over Norwich at Carrow Road. Solskjaer, meanwhile, conducted a farewell interview upon leaving United last month. He paid tribute to the players he worked with throughout his three-year spell in the dugout, as well as his coaches. Though he was unable to win a trophy, the United legend also insisted he was very, very proud of what he'd achieved. Very, very proud, said the retired striker. Of course, it's one of those things you dream of in your life. When you've been a player, when you've been a reserve team coach, the next job then, the only dream and the only thing you haven't done, is to manage the club, and I have now. It's been a ball, it's been absolutely enjoyable from the first to the last minute, so I have to thank all the players, because since I came in, they're top lads, top people. Some have come, some have gone, but all of them, they've been such an enjoyable bunch to work with. First of all, I want to thank the board and the owners for giving me the opportunity, because it's not for everyone, and I've had the opportunity. I'm so honored and privileged to have been trusted to take the club forward, and I really hope that I leave it in a better state than when I came. I've made great friends, I've reconnected with some great friends, new staff coming and I've become really good friends with. The other staff that was here when I was there, we're good friends, and we have connected, 